All right, it's time to work our core a little bit. We got a big superset here. It's gonna be a wide knee up to a cross mountain climber. So let's show them the wide knee up. You're in a big flat four point position here. You're gonna take the knee to the elbow. Show us a mountain climber, just a normal one. Right up the middle, not that, okay? We wanna get wider than that. So get this wide base, and then we're gonna crisscross it about the 30 second mark. So go ahead and rest a little bit. Get ready to rock it home. Go in that four point position. About four seconds here, ready? All right, let's bridge it up. Wide knee ups, here we go. Good. Work to keep that butt flat. If your core isn't that strong, your butt's gonna wanna climb. That's a good indication that you have a weak core. This is when we gotta start working on it and working to keep the butt down. If this one minute set here is a little too long for you, shorten the duration until you're ready to rock. He's in great shape though and he's ready to rock here. So keep pushing here, keep pushing, getting a good rhythm, squeeze your obliques throughout. All right, we're headed to the cross. Good. About 45 second to minute sets here, all right? These are gonna be a little long, you're gonna burn, but it's gonna be great for your core. Keep pushing, keep pushing. He's taking this opposite knee to his elbow and really squeezing in here for his abs. Come on, work, work. Got about 10 seconds. Don't give in early. Keep pushing. Four, three, two, one. Good, relax. It's always good that, to stretch your abs a little bit in between sets. Bridge up, he'll show you here. He bridges up, stretches abs. Lean to the left, lean to the right. Stretch your obliques a little bit. Core is the most important part of any type of speed and athlete training. This is what it, the foundation of your athleticism is, is, your core. Building your leg strength all the way up through your upper body, moving through your core. So really push it here. This is very important. Got about another eight seconds, so we're gonna get going again. All right. Wide knee ups. Ready, go. Go. Just get yourself in a good rhythm. I don't want you to go too fast because I want you to make sure you have a flat back. If we really get pushing it and start working for speed here, your butt's gonna start climbing and climbing and we're gonna lose that form. So just get in a good rhythm, good squeezes through your obliques. Good. A little bit quicker, a little bit quicker. As we finish this 30 second, let's get a little faster. Good. Four. Three, two, one. Cross knees, cross knees. Finish strong here. If your shoulders are burning, you gotta work. You gotta tell yourself it's good for you and get your mind right and push through. Come on, this advanced level stuff. Keep working, push yourself, push yourself. Come on now. 15, come on. Say yes, say yes. As that butt climbs, get it back down. Tell yourself you can do it. It's all mental here. Work your core, push. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Way to push through that set. Let's move on to the next exercise. All right, right into the oblique raises into a forward knee up. Let's show them first. We got an oblique raise. Drop that right side back. Reaching out this way, you're gonna close the gap, okay? Close it up. The key is here to stretch out your oblique and then go meet the knee come back for it. That's the oblique raise. Now we're gonna go with a forward knee up. So you drop the foot back, you come up, squeeze in the middle, all right? Core is more than just doing crunches. It's more than just bridges. Everything through your hips all the way up through your trunk is all core. This is gonna be a great mobile exercise for us. Let's start with the oblique raises here. Ready? Go. Good, get in a rhythm first and then we're gonna speed it up a little bit. Good, keep opening it up, closing the gap, closing the gap. All right, let's get in a bit of a rhythm, speed it up, speed it up. Really start trying to squeeze this oblique. Five, four, three, two, one, good, other side. Drop the foot back, open up the gap, let's get, really exaggerate your form here. Go. Open it up, close the gap, open it up, close the gap. More movement through our trunk. You really wanna move through your trunk here, okay? Good, keep pushing, keep pushing. All right, let's start speeding it up. Let's start speeding it up. Drive that knee to your chest and really pull those arms back to squeeze that oblique. Four, three, two, one. 
relax, shake them a little bit. All right, we got a quick burst here with a forward knee up. So we're going right leg back, hands are up, and you're gonna really power through and squeeze in your abs here, okay? Take your chest down to your knee. All right, ready? Quick set, ready, go. Squeeze, squeeze, come on, push, push. Don't leave the chest high, come down and meet the knee. Come down and meet the knee. Four, three, two, one. Other side, right into it. We got a break right after this. Come on, push, push, push. Meet the knee, meet the knee, squeeze the abs. Come on now, dig, dig, dig. Five, four, three, push it home. Two, one, relax. Good, walk around, catch your breath. Every single time that we do this forward knee raise, we wanna get here, and as we get here, we gotta squeeze our abs. Don't be lazy and just leave it in your hip flexor. If you're just lifting your leg like this, all hip flexor. If I work and crunch down into it, I'm gonna work my whole core, okay? Bands are gonna be a great, great supplement to this lift, gonna add a lot to it. Take a deep breath. Going back to those obliques, forward knee ups, got about 20 seconds. Walk around, put your hands on your head if you need to catch your breath a little more. You're doing great, keep working. Been a big day today, so keep pushing, all right? Don't give in. All right. Got that right leg drop back. Remember to exaggerate it at the beginning. We wanna open up this chest. Come back to that knee. Ready, go. Good, good. He's doing great here. Make sure you're doing that at home. Open up the chest, right back to the knee. Good, good, come back to it, come back to it. Squeeze in your oblique. A little fast, a little fast, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, shake your legs a little bit. Let's go into the other one. Get the hands up, exaggerate the motion in the beginning here. Good, ready, go. Good, come on, push, push. Good. Nice and long, arms are out, squeezing the obliques. All right, let's pick it up. We got seven seconds. A little quick, a little quicker, a little quicker. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Deep breath, shake your legs around a little bit. We got our quick bursts of our forward knees up here. All right, right leg back, hands up high. Take that chest down to the knee and squeeze the abs. Ready? Go. Come on, push with it. Push. You got to work. You got to work. Dig, 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 squeeze your abs. Four, three, two, one, good. Other side. Stay long with it, ready, go. Good. You gotta open up your chest just like that. Open your chest, go back and meet the knee. Push, push, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great set, great set. Way to push yourself. These are tough. Just keep working. It's gonna challenge your endurance a little bit, but you did great. Let's move into the next exercise. Now we're gonna move into bridges. We're gonna do a front bridge, side bridge, and a side bridge without going down. Let's show them it real quickly. Front bridge, elbows are bent, feet are up. He's not got his hips up or down. Nice flat, all right, no hyperextension in your back, nice and flat. Roll over to that side bridge. He's got his feet on top of one another. He's in a nice straight line here. That's where you need to be. And obviously the other way is just rolling to the other side. Just like that. All right, so relax real quick. Get ready to rock at home. Going to have a couple little turns here. It's going to be a nice set here for us to get a good burn through our core. Ready to rock? Everybody up. Go. Good. Good squeeze. Good squeeze. All right. Three, two, one. Headed to the left. Good. Squeeze your core. Squeeze your core. Getting a nice flat line here. That's perfect. Three, two, one. Middle. Good, good and squeezed. He's got his good flat bridge. Make sure you're there with us, all right? Don't get all bowed up. Keep pushing, right side, here we go. Make sure that you don't stick this butt out and you keep your hips forward just like this, stay in a straight line. Get to the middle again, right on that forward bridge. Good, perfect. As you get tired, if you can't stick with us all these sets, keep working for it. Each and every week you're gonna get there to the left. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Make sure you're not sagging low here or way too high. You want to be right here in the middle, just like that. Three, two, one, middle. Good. 
Keep working, keep working. We're finishing right here. We're finishing, so keep pushing. Don't give in now. Four, three, two, one. Relax. Good. Again, you can stretch your abs during this portion. Your obliques kind of might be barking a little bit as well. Take a slight turn to the right or left. Keep working here. You're going to have about a 30, 40 second rest in between these sets. So take a lot of deep breaths. We're going to work that core here. Bridges are one of the most beneficial things that you can do for your core. You know, those standing core exercises are going to be good to make it more of a sports specific movement. But bridges are going to work our core better than any amount of crunches we can do. You got to work your core from different movements to strengthen around our spine. That's the key, all right? We're ready to rock? All right, starting in the middle. Here we go. Good. Still got those good bridges. As we get tired, you're going to want to climb. Got to stay flat, all right? Keep pushing. Keep pushing. All right, off to the right. Good. He's got great form. His feet are stacked just like they're supposed to be. We don't want to have one foot out here in the grass and one over there. Just stack them right up onto the middle. Head over to the middle. Good. Keep those shoulders nice and neutral. We don't want these elbows too high or too low. Right under his shoulders. Left side. Keep squeezing. You're doing great. Keep working at home. Keep working. This is when it's all going to pay off. Towards the end of the workout when you got to dig down. Middle. Keep pushing here. Keep pushing. Squeeze your abs. Make sure that you're staying flat. It's all a mental game here when we work our core with bridges. Right side. Push, push. Make sure we're staying open. Just like that. Good. Keep working. Middle. Got to get over to the left and then middle and you're done. So keep focusing. Keep pushing. I know you're burning. I know you're feeling it. Left side. Good. Keep those hips forward. Don't let that butt slide out on the back ones either. Middle. Here you go. Finish strong with that five second count. Three, two, one. Relax. Good. Got one more set of these. Keep pushing yourself. Core exercises can be a little bit monotonous. You know, you're going to keep going and keep going. And you're feeling an out of control burn through here. As you get stronger, you're going to be able to hone this a little bit more and build more of those stability muscles in our core that are going to correlate to sport. All right? Work hard through these exercises. They're going to be tough, but keep pushing. You're doing great. Deep breath here. Got about 20 seconds to go. If your shoulders are getting tired, this is a good time to stretch your arms out a little bit. A little to the left, a little to the right. Sometimes our stability muscles there are going to get a little fatigued. All right. Let's finish up strong here on this exercise. Start with that middle bridge again. Here we go. Keep going here. Good. Let's get that good squeeze. Off to the left. Finish strong. Come on, tell yourself you're doing all right. Off to the middle. As an athlete, if you think about how much you burn, if you think about how much you're getting tired, then you're never going to be mentally tough. Head to the right. You got to tell yourself you can get through anything. You got to work to compete and push yourself through these types of exercises. It's going to make you a better athlete, going to make you mentally tough. To the middle. Keep work. Keep working. Come on, this is challenging. You're doing all right. Come on, push. To the left. Good, good, good. Come on. Keep that good form. Keep your hips forward. To the middle. We got to get back around. We got to get back around. You can do it. You can do it. To the right. Good. Breathe. Don't just hold your breath there. You got to breathe. Let's head to the middle and finish it up here. We're working hard. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Great set. Remember, those bridges are tough. If you only got through one and a half sets, don't cut it short every single time. Each week, you got to progressively try to get better. If you don't push yourself and try to get where we're at, then you're not going to get any better, all right? Keep working hard and keep pushing to be that elite athlete you want to be. Let's get into the next exercise. All right, let's move right into a bit of a dynamic side bridge rollover, okay? Let's show them here at home. So we get up on our 
bridged on the left side and we're going to roll over onto our toes and keep our butt flat while maintaining that whole flat back all the way down. It's going to be great for our core, a little bit of stability muscles as we move. Got 30 seconds. Ready? Go. Good. Nice and slow and controlled. We don't need to go for speed here. Just once we get there, open up and we close back up. Good and controlled. Keep working. Come on, push, push, push. Good. He's got his good flat back. He's rocking over. As soon as he touches, he's going again. Four, three, two. Come on, get you another one. And relax. Let's head over to the other side. Right into this set here. So he's bridged up on his right. He's good and flat here. He's going to roll over to his toes. Come on down to the middle. Here we go. Good. Push yourself. Push yourself. Good. Notice that his butt isn't coming up. Do this rep with your butt up. We don't want to get here, okay? We want to keep that back flat. Keep pushing. You got about 12 more seconds. Keep pushing. Squeeze that core. Stay flat. Just rocking onto your toes here. Four, three, two, one. Relax. Good set. Way to push yourself at home. Again, this is one of these exercises that is pretty tough. And if you can't quite do it with the proper form, just stick to a front bridge until your core gets a little stronger. And then you can move into these supermans and different exercises where we're rocking and rolling like this, okay? We got another 30 seconds on each side, and then we're going to finish strong with a bicycle and in and out, okay? Keep working here. All right. Ready. Go. Rolling it over, squeezing the abs. A little bit slower on the way back. We want to be controlled the whole way through here. Good. Great for core. Great for core strength here. Keep pushing. Come on now. About another 10 seconds. You got it in you. Stay strong. Good. Perfect form. Work on it at home. If that butt's rising, you don't want that. And relax. Other side. We got to make sure that our spine stays in line as we do core strength in the exercises. Ready? Go. If we're working out of alignment, we're not going to get the right kind of strength that we want. We want strength that holds our body together. Okay? Keep working. We want our leg power to move through our core, out our limbs. That's the name of the game here. So we just got to keep working through these exercises. Come on, we got 11 seconds. Come on, push. Push. Tell yourself, yes, you can do it. Come on. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Great set. Keep pushing yourself. Final core exercise here. We got to hit it hard. Let's go for bicycles and in and out. Let's get a little intensity here. It's one burnout here and then we're done, all right? So let's check out the bicycle quickly. Right elbow, left knee, vice versa. Keep going, all right? In out. We're going to be up a little bit. Hands are out here. Fingers facing forward, knees are up. We're gonna flare out wide, just like that. Big burner set here, all right? Ready, here we go. Come on, push yourself at home. Push yourself at home. I know the Superman's got to you. I know the rolling core exercise got to you. Now we just gotta finish it off. We gotta strengthen right through the middle. Come on, rock the shoulders, rock the shoulders. Come on, work, work, get the legs straight. Push yourself, push yourself, push, push. Five, four, three, two, one, in and outs, right into them, right into them. Get the legs out wide, let the bands work. Push, push. I know you're burning. Come on, work, work. Great for hip flexors, great for the thighs, great for the core here. Come on, push through, push through. You got 12 seconds in you, you can do it. Come on now. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Way to push through the core exercise. Great workout today. Keep working hard each and every day. I'm telling you, it's all going to pay off.